Let's talk audio for a second. I just want to say a massive thank you to the sponsor of today's video, which is Majority Audio. They've sent out their Studio One headphones. Now, there's a few key pointers about these that are different to your standard headphones. So let's talk about it, shall we? But first, looking over the build quality, this is your premium quality headphones. Like, I mean, they do what most headphones do with the standard folding and adjustments for your head size and so forth. But even though they are foldable, they are not wireless, so the cable will be there no matter what. I've actually found myself going back to old videos using these and realizing the audio was not the best. Now, a lot of people will abide by this by saying audio is key. Video doesn't actually matter about the quality. You can always watch a video at bad quality compared to audio. You cannot listen to music when it's distorted and sounds absolutely terrible. With build quality, they're rugged. They're made to be snug on the head and not to be loose and flopping around. So that's why I wouldn't want to pull them too much because I feel like I would damage the structure and make it weaker over time. So on the top, you have this absolutely insane padding, which just gives utter comfort on the top of your dome. Yeah, a lot of headphones do that. They add the padding at the top to help with comfort, but this is a different kind of padding. I don't know what it is about it. It just allows you to wear them for a stupid amount of time and not even realize they're on your head. As you can see with the cups on the ears here, they are closed back over the ears and that gives it more of a professional monitoring when listening to audio. It blocks out all the sound from outside and allows you to sort of zone in on the pitches, the tones and the frequencies that you're listening to. As I mentioned before, they're foldable, lightweight. They don't weigh a lot at all. Being this very durable plastic, you know you can throw them in your bag and they're not gonna get damaged when you pull them back out. These provide a very powerful studio sounding audio as they are supplied with 50 millimeter drivers. That allows you to have crystal clear audio for clarity and ultimate comfort at the same time with the padding of the earmuffs and that top guard bit there. I've been using these now for a couple of weeks and I mean the difference that I've noticed, not only with editing because I do a lot of that, but with music when I'm sitting there listening into YouTube videos, I can hear, it feels like I'm in the room with the person making the video because they are that clear, it feels, and the fact that they sit over your ears, it just, it, it narrows down all the audio signal directly into your eardrum and it just sounds so damn good. The only thing I would say is the adjustable bits, they are, they don't have a tactile click, so you don't know what part of the headphone you actually clicked into, you have to physically look. So you have from zero to eight in adjustability, but there isn't that tactile click to let you know which one you're at. You sort of just have to either wing it when it's on your head or physically look and say, right, if it was good at four, I'll put that to four, put that to four. And sometimes you will notice it does slide down if you're moving around a bit. But other than that, that's the only downfall that I've actually found so far. I haven't found any delay in audio. There's no signal loss. There's no distortion, no tearing. The ear cups haven't deflated after time because obviously being pushed in for so long, you'd think the ear muffs would deflate where they haven't. They've stayed at the exact same shape as they did coming out of the box. It does come with a coiled cable, which allows up to three meters of length when walking around. I don't know why you'd walk that far away from where you're plugged in, but it's always good to have when you sort of want to just sit back and you don't have to worry about pulling off all your stuff on the desk. So with the original jack, it is a 3.5 millimeter jack, but they do give you an extension of a 6.5 millimeter jack for obviously your audio systems, your amplifiers and things like that will use a bigger jack. They are both gold plated for the best connectivity, but there are sometimes you get these and they're not plated properly and you'll plug it in and you'll get that sort of the buzzing or the discomfort of noise not really playing properly as it should be because it's not connecting right or it's not having the right connections with the interface that it's plugged into. So I'm gonna say who are these probably best for and I say this a lot, but everyone. I haven't found that there's been a specific type of need for these when it comes to editing, YouTube watching, gaming, they just, they're an overall piece of equipment that I find necessary. As working from home, I'm always on the PC and I need something to sort of put over my head, drown out the noise and get on with work. And that's what they do exactly. Even having them on there was hard to talk because I couldn't really hear my voice. So I didn't know what I was sounding like. So I apologize if I was shouting, but I do like the coiled cable. I don't know what it is with coiled cables. They just look better on the desk or just lying around. They give it that more of a professional feel. I don't know. Uh, it, it keeps it all tidy as well. It keeps it all in one compact area. And if you want to extend it, you can just sort of walk around with it. Build quality, mainly plastic, but a durable plastic at that. 
You do have these cups on the side here with the majority logo and it's in like a metal finish. They look the part, they do the part and an even price range. I mean, wow. These are actually coming in cheaper than some of the other branded headsets for gaming and other things like that. These are at £43.95p. That is in UK British pounds. And for that price, you are getting the best quality audio that you possibly could get. You're looking at getting a Razer headset for gaming. Again, around 150 pounds when these do just that. And I mean, I used to use some headphones from Supso and when they sent them out, they're around the 200 pound mark. And yet these still give me better clarity and better audio than some of the most expensive ones on the market. For the low price of 43 pound 95, you can grab yourself a pair of these. And I mean, I'm surprised they are this cheap. I must admit, when I looked, I did not think they would be so cheap. They come with a carry case and having two jack sizes allows you to have versatility of where you're gonna be using them. So, so well done to majority audio for making such a quality product for such a budget friendly price like but yeah I will let you decide yourself if you buy a pair of these let me know in the comments below what you thought of them if you already own a pair of these let me know what you think of them obviously it helps people with a second opinion on whether they should buy these or not but for me these are perfect they do the job exactly as I need it to do so if you want to check these out go in the description click the link and go and have a look at what other stuff they do on their website because they do a crazy amount of sound systems which we're actually going to get into in the next couple of videos so a massive thank you to majority audio for sponsoring this video this isn't a biased review like all the other youtubers say this is literally me telling you I've actually found some that I enjoy using and I want you to experience it with me. If I didn't like a product, oh, they'd know about it. But other than that, capture, create, captivate. That's what we've done here today and I'll see you all in the next video.